Dr. Waswa William is bringing digital detection to cervical cancer care. He has developed quick scanning digital microscopes, which he makes with a 3D printer. His software then quickly scans and analyzes patient samples. Our innovation can provide timely, accurate diagnosis, but can also help look at cells that are actually coming or becoming cancerous. Because the computer has been trained, it knows how a, 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 a cancer cell looks like, so it can actually predict. Dr. Waswa says his system is 97% accurate. The innovation has also been peer-reviewed in several academic journals. This fabricated 3D microscope is able to detect and digitize cervical cancer cells in just under 10 minutes compared to the manual diagnosis that requires up to two weeks analysis. The manual method requires cancer experts to analyze samples through a microscope. Dr. Waswa says that is more time consuming and may be prone to human errors. His system is still going through scientific trials and is currently being tested in a local hospital. Digital microscopes are not readily available in low income countries because they are expensive. But Dr. Waswa hopes to change that. In a very busy setting, they can actually tell you to come back in one or two weeks to pick your results. And because of this, some patients actually don't go back to pick results. Because research has shown that there is a lot of loss to patient follow-up. That's why patients, some patients go, but they tell them come for your results, they actually don't go to pick the results. In Uganda, 40% of all cancer cases are cervical cancer patients. The Uganda Cancer Institute says uptake for cervical cancer screening is still low and many patients arrive when it's too late. The Cancer Institute says in order to prevent deaths, innovations like Dr. Wasser's are welcome. But it warns better access to care is needed to prevent deaths. The number of people who at least know something about cancer has gone up to about 7% in the country. So that means actually awareness has also doubled, which is, which is a good thing. But now, creating awareness and people being aware without them having access to care will be meaningless. So that means we need to do more. Dr. Waswa is also working on training his machine to analyze other forms of cancer. He's working with hospitals around the country to adopt his technology to improve access to quick and timely diagnosis at affordable costs. Isabel Nakiria, CGTN Barara, Western Uganda.